All right, I just want to show you a little bit about what my car does. I have been waiting on a new steering column for my 2017 Chevy Bolt since January of this year. It is just about Halloween now, so we are looking at a solid 10 months of wait time on a steering column. <clears throat> it was under warranty when I brought it in. So there's a warranty claim to get a new steering column, but Chevy has uh, now told me to not expect one and are trying to set me up into a new car in payments that I can't afford or I can drive around an unsafe vehicle. And so they're proposing to give me $3,500 in a customer loyalty cash for uh, to add into my trade value, which is not good because of a problem that they can't fix that's of no fault of my own so uh doesn't seem very fair to me i don't know if it might seem fair to some other people out there maybe actuaries that are looking at numbers and not looking at the human side of things but this is uh this is what it does the steering just doesn't return at all and so if I put it into a turn, no hands, and it just keeps going in a big circle. Still going. Still going. And it just doesn't come back. literally can just do this for hours and it won't return at all it's stuck oh and it does it the other way too so just trucking in a big circle yep my legs aren't even touching it nope it's just going Now I'm dizzy. Wow. So, Chevy's refusing to fix my car because they can't get the parts in. Blaming it on the strike, but it all happened before UAW striked. And uh, they're trying to put me in saying I can only use, only get a new car with this customer loyalty cash that they're wanting to provide. And it puts me, the cheapest car they have will still put me into payments that I can't afford. I just want to keep this car because I love it. But it's broken and Chevy's putting me into a tough spot. What do you think? <laughs>